Hello, welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Part 11. Yeah, 11. I find it weird how the level between Donald and Goofy is so drastic. Like, Donald is level 7 and Goofy's level 11. Kinda, kinda weird. Oh gosh. I'm here to shop. I wanna buy things. Reduces lightning, reduces fire. I guess that's good for specific bosses. But, you know, whatever. I think we'll be good. Actually, what am I saying? Again, this game is harder than uh, Kingdom Hearts 2. So yeah, we, we might wanna we have this now, so that might help. I thought I didn't I thought you got this until I thought you got got the dodgeball much later into the game. But now it's actually quite an early thing. I guess I could buy more things for Donald and Goofy. But I wanna buy more potions. Add some to the stock. Damn it. Add some to the stock. And I guess we're good. I don't know what the rest of them have to sell. Probably nothing important. So, now that we've uh, delayed our adventure, I just don't know if there's a good way to uh, get rid of this. I thought it was something with the. Whatever. I think it's something you might get later in the game or something? I, I don't know. Whatever, I don't care. We're not, we're not dealing with that. You can also save it uh, at some save point, but, uh... You know, it's more more cinematic when you leave for the exit door thing. I don't think they had exit doors in, uh, Kingdom Hearts 2. Select the destination or the cursor. Did I have in Kingdom Hearts 2? I should've... Again, I should've played... Let's play these games in order, but, you know, whatever. Instead of Kingdom Hearts 2 where you run around, you just pick. And then you have to fly within between every single world, unless you have like some sort of warp thing. But damn it! I tried to push right and then X, and then only X got registered. Damn it! I'm gonna kill myself. Change my desk. I changed my desktop background. I don't know why that's important. I just feel like I don't oftenly change desktop back, but my desk top background, so, you know, I think it's a major event. Battle level 1 star, battle level 2 stars. I guess I'll do the normal battle level 1 star. In Kingdom Hearts 2, they had more specific things. They have. Again, I probably should stop. Whatever. Whatever. Toilet gummy ship, blah blah blah. I don't care. This is reverse controls. It feels kind of awkward. Yeah. These levels seem like they're more, I don't know. The Kingdom Hearts 2, uh, gummy stages are a lot more better, but I don't know, I kinda like what they, what this is. The way, there's a way to slow down. Is there any way to speed up? I don't know. I never really bothered too much with gummy things. I think I occasionally made vehicles in Kingdom Hearts 2 that weren't all that impressive, but it's fun to screw around with, you know. I think the puppy dogs, if you rescue all the puppy dogs, you, I think, I think the reward for rescuing all the puppy dogs is that you get a, some, that you get something that lets you just have an unlimited amount of parts on your gummy ship. Like, normally you're limited how many parts you're allowed to add, but like, if you get that, I think, don't think there's a limit. At least I know there's something that doesn't give you a limit. Or I mean, I might be completely insane. But I think there might be something that just gives you unlimited things. You can make like freaking huge gummy ships. 
Again, I could be completely insane. Uh, he's a lot slower than the one in Kingdom Hearts 2. Disembark! Hey, we're disembarking me. What? Click. Does that click my computer? Or not my computer, my PlayStation 2 breaking? I really need a new PlayStation 2, but I don't have any money! So we're just gonna have to deal with it now. Silly rabbit. That's really disorienting. I gotta like this world, but I do remember it being kind of annoying. I don't think I can use this yet. So, we're gonna move on. Yeah, I don't remember what I remember. I think it's something where you have to find stuff, crap, and it's difficult, and blah, blah, blah. But it's a fun world nonetheless. It's a decent introductory world. I guess you could go to the other world, but you'd probably get your ass handed to you. Since that's a higher level cap. Nah, I'm big. The doorknob is talking! What bottle? Oh, the bottle? You mean the bottle that just magically appeared? I think that's fantastic. I don't know if you can drink both bottles. Or if you have a choice. I think one just grows you small, one grows you huge. Yay, now we're small. Ah, now they're enemies. There weren't enemies before. You're lying to me. This is a shenanigans video game. Did that magic actually hit? You generate magic, not based on time, but like, I think like how many, each time you hit an, an attack on an enemy it goes up, and uh, each time you collect a little bubble it goes up. I think the only magic, yeah, I don't know, magic is, again, useful. Some people prefer this game over Kingdom Hearts 2, but, but I think most people prefer the second one. But I could see why some people prefer this one, since it's, like, more strategy-oriented instead of just a button mash. But, hey, what can I say? Oh my god, these freaking enemies. Hi, right, Goofy, you're just ramming that guy. I don't like stupid enemies, stupid invincibility frames. I need to stop having stupid invincibility frames. What did you just murder? What is going on? Why won't these enemies stop appearing? How in the middle of your combo can you dodge roll away? Whatever. Hello. Can we go through now? Wake up! Uh. Uh. Again, I haven't played this game in like years, so you know. I don't think we have the green thing yet. Man, I don't remember like anything about this game. I think I remember like something around like the first like the first two or three worlds, but like beyond that, my memory's like Zer. Maybe now, even now, my memory's like Zer. Do I shoot him with magic? He won't. He won't wake up. Uh. <laughs> This is a quite fascinating room. Can I get through here? I don't think I can get through here at the moment. What do you want me to do, video game? Uh, I, don't, I don't understand. Do I need to drink the thing, move the thing out of the way, and then... I don't know. 
Uh, can I, like... Oh, here we are. There we go. That's what I was supposed to do first. Crafty, crafty little video game here we have. Whee! Queen's Castle. Now that we have that pushed out of the way, we can go through here! And I think a cutscene might activate. I'm not sure. I think, I think it, I am true on that because the music is quiet and now it's watching a cutscene. PlayStation 2, I hear, is dying. Rabbit. I find it funny. I find the rabbit funny. The rabbit silly. Early PS2 graphics and lip syncing at their finest. Bring me evidence of Alice is innocent. Hell, and it's off with all of your head. Gather much or a little evidence that you please. Report back here once you're ready. I think, I think the thing is that you don't have to get all the evidence, but it's the best, but it's better to get all the evidence. But I don't really think it matters, though. But anyway, yeah, well, I guess we'll try to get the evidence.